it's, that's, but that's the right name, right? Yeah. Yeah, the number doesn't matter as long as the right account. The system just pick a number that I put on the receipt. But as long as the same name, you're good. I'm filming you. Oh, it's on sale. It is? How much? 16 plus. Five. Are you still gonna get the same commission? It doesn't matter, girl. $18, okay? $17.99. Fucking problems with your baby. I got 99 problems. I got 99 fucking problems. And depression is one of them. And depression is one of them, for real, for real. Can I turn here? Yeah. There's like a popo over. Oh shit, ambulance day. Oh my god, yo. Can I turn here or not? Dude, I think it's closed. Oh shit, yo. You'd have to well, go. Well, actually, what if I go around? No, it says oh, the building, building closed. is closed. It literally says building closed. Like. Alright, so. Um, do you want to go to like CVS and use the ATM there? What? Do you want to go to CVS and use the ATM there? Sure. You have to go to CVS anyways. Oh. The can, we, right there. can we go to um, the one on North Frederick Avenue? Which one's that one? The one over here? By, uh, it's just on North Frederick Avenue. I don't know where... Like, I Not that far from... Because my brother walks there to get all my prescriptions, but one of my prescriptions isn't. Oh, so which one is North Frederick Avenue? Like is I said, my brother gets it, not me. But it's... It's not that far from my house. Is it... Is it like down that way? Um, I don't think so. Or is it the one by Chipotle over here? I don't know. Girl, look that I just shit know. Up. I just know it's in a plaza. Oh, okay. I got you then. Wait, do I? Do I got you? North Frederick Avenue. There's like hella police. I hate Gaithersburg. <laughs> you know, like, have you ever done cocaine before? <laughs> yeah. Do you like it? Uh, it was okay. That shit is crazy. Ooh, I was gonna like honk my horn. Molly is better though. Everyone keeps talking about Molly, but I'm so afraid of taking pills. Like, I okay, so right, okay, here we go. My story. So I, my friend, she has a bunch of fucking problems. Like. You think you have problems? People with problems tend to attract people with problems. You know what? I think that's so. I think I have problems too. Like no lie. Like I just don't know them because I can't afford a psychiatrist. <laughs> so whatever. But like, so this bitch, like, we would do coke all the time, but like we couldn't sleep, and so she'd be like, "Here's a Xanax, or take two of them, so you can sleep, or whatever." And I was like, "Bet." So, dude, I took two Xanaxes, and that was, like, the best fucking sleep of my life. How much was it? Like, milligrams? It was, like, I think it was 0. 0.25 or 0. 0.5 milligrams. Uh. But, um, yeah, so, this, so I was taking, like, two Xanaxes every night, and, like, I was getting the best sleep of my life, and then out of nowhere, like, during the day, something random would happen, and I would get the worst panic attack. Like, yeah. I would break down That's into tears. like, withdrawal from Yeah, it. that shit was so scary because it was, like, uncontrollable. And, like, I was, like, I literally felt I like dying. I think it's that way, no. Maybe I, it's that way. I got you, I got you. That's not an only, right? Oh, I'm good. So, anyways, um, yeah. So, I took these Xanaxes, right? And, like, my life was pretty cool. I was like, damn, this shit is dope. Like, you fucking get chill. It's like weed, but without. I know what Xanax is. I used to take it, but it wasn't strong enough for me. So but I, I didn't. Take... I didn't know like what it was. I hear about rappers talking about it, <laughs> and I'm just like trying to know what the hype's about. <laughs> that's your advertising. Like, I guess. And, and, and like, I took that shit, dude. And like, if it was weird because when I had these panic attacks, like, I just had to pop a Xanax or two, and like, I was fine. Like, yeah. I was calm. That's what it's for. It's for panic attacks. I know, but the thing is, like, it induces panic attacks because I don't get panic attacks like that. Like, I'll have anxiety Yeah, it's shit. it's it's for short-term treatment. Yeah, you're but supposed that to, like, is, like, awful, bro. You're like, supposed to take it and then go into, like, therapy or something, and then you only take it for, like, a few weeks. It's not something you're supposed to take long-term. Well, Xanax, some people it, take it for a long time, and apparently you can get, like, seizures and shit if, like, you try to come off of it. 
Oh yeah, if if you're on a high dose and then you try to just suddenly stop, oh my God. that can. My heart goes out to anybody who like. Oh sorry. My heart goes out. Sorry, dude, my bad. My heart goes out to anybody who like has issues with that shit. Like. I need to eat something, but I'm not hungry, so I'm gonna be like forcing myself to eat. I've been so depressed lately. Words cannot describe how depressed I've been for the past few weeks. Um, I haven't been ignoring you guys. I've just been so upset. And I've decided that whenever I am um, fall into one of those episodes because that's what it is, it's episodic I'm just gonna ride it out and let it happen and I'll just eat my weight in pizza and take my medication and try to be unconscious as much as possible um, because that's the thing with bipolarity it has to end eventually and with me, this episode ended just recently, like yesterday. So, I'm trying to get back out there. I haven't forgot about you guys or anything like that. I feel really bad that I haven't been making videos, but at the same time, I don't want to put pressure on myself because that's when I get stressed and that just makes me sicker. I'm working on my own stuff. Everything that I'm doing right now, besides these videos, I'm doing for me. I do write and compose songs, and I want to be a filmmaker. But at this point in time, I'm just working on myself, doing everything for myself. <laughs> 